Hi guys, Rosie here. Good morning. I'm drinking in the wrong cup today. I'm in the Mr. Cup instead of the Mrs. Cup, but hey, whatever. A little cafe con leche. All right. I just wanted to show you guys <clears throat> the rest of my Dollar Tree haul. Um, <laughs> you know, there's always a bag left in the car or sitting in the kitchen. And <laughs> and then I after I post the video, I'm like, wait a minute. I know I I got some other stuff besides the stuff I showed in the video. Like, where's this and where's this and where's that? So <laughs> you can see my little red truck and the wagon sitting up on the window behind me and so yesterday i was sitting there watching tv after i posted the video and i said wait a minute there's a bunch of stuff that i didn't show that i know i bought so found the bag it was in the kitchen and just gonna show you really quickly what they are so again shout out to the oni from thrifty divas i watch all of her videos i love her she finds some great stuff very inspiring to go out and find stuff for gifts. Um, she likes to do a lot of giveaways and mail stuff to people. And I love that about her. She's a very um, giving person. And <clears throat> so I, I just love that about her. I love a lot of the stuff that she finds. They're just absolutely adorable. So one of the things I went out and I found at Dollar Tree was this lash candle it says fabulous on it now you guys know that that's absolutely me right there and it smells so good it says the rose collection new york on it and it says poinsettia and fur and it does have like this i'm trying to figure out what the smell is let me just take off the card it says poinsettia and fur, and it does kind of smell like Christmassy, like. I don't know how to really put, put my finger on it, but yeah, I would say it's like poinsettia and fur, kind of a, a combination of both. Kind of Christmassy, I don't know. I, I don't know how to describe it, but they're so cute. They had different ones that had different sayings on it, but you know, I had to get the fabulous one. And uh, my husband was standing right there like, no, don't buy that. <laughs> so, yeah, I had to grab it. Then the other cute thing I found, this is for a gift. How cute is that? It has the little dream catcher image on it. And it says, don't give up on your dreams. And it has the little dream catcher. So I'm definitely going to be giving this to one of my friends as a gift how adorable i just couldn't resist it they had some other ones um it looks a little beat up over here on the ends but that's okay because i can definitely go over it with some mod podge and kind of fix it up and make it look a little bit prettier but it's such a cute gift for a dollar and i know whoever i give it to um they'll really love it and enjoy it so that that was really cute all right, so I picked that up. Then they have so many candles, you guys. And I just wanted to buy all of them. I, I was like, I fell in love with all of them. So I got this one as well. Oh, it smells so good. It says crown chakra on it. And it says cosmic energy and bliss. Soy blend scented candle, and it just smells so, so relaxing, guys. I just absolutely love it. So I'm definitely gonna turn this one on in the room, um, when I'm ready, getting ready to go to bed. Oh, it smells so good. And they had a bunch of different other ones that said different things on top and chakra. So I kind of really like that. I'm kind of into that sort of stuff too. So yeah, I like that. That was really cute. All right. <clears throat> then you guys have seen me um buy the Bolero products. And I love that coconut and rose milk soap. You guys know that I bought, went back and I bought like two more of them. 
So, um, I went to a different Dollar Tree this time. Actually, this stuff, I didn't buy it from the Dollar Tree where I got yesterday's haul. Now that I think about it. I think we stopped at two different Dollar Trees. Um, and, um, I think this one, I got it more off of the Clifton's, the Clifton Town side over, um, by Route 3. And, um, yeah, so I found these two Bolero soaps. They were different scents. How cute are those? Oh, my God. I'm so excited. This blue one says coconut and rose oil, pure vegetable soap made with natural coconut and rose oil. And it's supposed to be a moisturizing soap. So. You guys know how much I love that other Bolero um, rose and coconut, um, the coconut and rose milk. So let's open this one up. Okay, it's the same size. And it almost smells the same. Maybe because it's the coconut. I don't know, but it almost smells the same. So I'm excited about that because let me tell you that first bar of soap that I bought. So remember, if you guys remember, I bought one and then I went back and I bought two more. That first bar of soap, I opened it and I've been using it for the past two weeks. Dude, it's still not finished. Like, I'm like, is this soap bar ever going to finish? It lasts forever. So I really like that. And I have two more in stock. And then, now I got this one, and it smells like coconut as well, so I'm excited about that. Then this one, oh man, it has all this glitter on it. It says hibiscus and pink clay, pure vegetable soap, nourishing. So this one is nourishing, this one is moisturizing. And it says made with natural hibiscus and pink clay. And you know what's funny? They had the same way they had like the wipes and the facial wash and the oil serum and, and the body spray and the lotion, all that stuff for the other, um, like the first round of Bolero products that they came out with. They had all that stuff for this as well. I didn't pick it up. I just wanted the soap just to try it because I still have a lot of the the other wipes and and the face wash and all that stuff so let's see this one okay looks the same oh this one smells amazing oh wow it's it says hibiscus pink and pink clay Hmm, I'm trying to figure out what sodium palmate, sodium palm kernelate, water, perfume. I guess it's just a whatever perfume fragrance. Oh, that smells so good. It's very flowery, you guys. So if you guys don't like flowery soaps, I wouldn't advise you to get this because it smells very flowery. Like that very sweet perfumey flowery smell but we're gonna try it and see i liked it the other two so yeah so that's it for the rest of the haul so i got the two hibiscus the hibiscus and the hub oh my god i can't talk again hibiscus and pink clay and the coconut and rose oil soap so i gotta take these back up um and then I got the cute little decor thing for a gift. Don't give up on your dreams with the dream catcher. That's really cute. Um, Yeah, so I'm just going to like decoupage it a little bit and fix it up. I didn't realize that it, it had a little bit of damaging on the corner, but that's okay. Whoever I give it to, I'm sure they will love it. And then the other two candles. The crown chakra and the fabulous lash. I can't wait to burn this one. Mm, that one smells good. All right, guys. So that was it for the rest of my haul. 
and i hope to see you guys again shortly Ooh, all those stunts they went on my nose all right guys so i'll talk to you guys soon and stay tuned for my upcoming um valentine's day um beat and i will be doing my face for valentine's day tomorrow i hope you guys have a wonderful valentine's day i hope you guys are enjoying prepping for valentine's day getting hair did nails did all that jazz right and i'll talk to you guys tomorrow all right have a good one and stay dry it's kind of rainy outside today mm -hmm. all right talk to you guys soon bye